Hello guys, welcome to Amit Things. In this video, we will see how we can insert records into a table in SQL Server. So here in first we created Amit DB database using the following command. Then we created a table employee. You can see the database we created Amit DB. Here it is. Under that we created employee table. The employee table we created is having four fields. The first one is int and the last one is int. That is int ID and salary is int integer and employee name and CTR for are being given varchar types data type. Now let us insert a record. For inserting records, we'll be using insert into command. Let's write. So here we wrote insert into employee. Insert into employee is a table name as you can see here. Now let us mention the fields one by one. ID. When you will type, it will automatically show under autocomplete. Press enter. City. Select and press enter. Salary. Select and press enter. So it's easy. Now write values and insert records one by one. At first, we will insert only a single row. So for ID, let us write one. Let us enter in quotes. Employee name. Let us write Tom. City. Let us write a sample ABC. Salary. Let us write any value in it. Okay. So now it's fine. Semicolon. Now we will select this and click on Execute to enter the first row in our employee table. Here you can see the messages. Drag it. You can see one row affected. Completion time. That means we have successfully added records in the table. Now let us see the record we have added using the select star command. Select star from table name. Table name is employee. Semicolon. Select it and execute. After executing in the result section, you can see we successfully added one record in the table. Okay, now for another record, let us implement the command again. Let us add the second record. Emma. Okay, now execute it, select it, click on execute. One row affected. Now let us mention the command again. Select star from employee. That's it. Select it and execute. That's it. Now you can see we have inserted two records ID, employee name, city, and salary. In this way, guys, you can insert records in your Microsoft SQL Server table using the insert into command. If you like the video, do subscribe to our channel. Amit things.